Hey, it's Tracy at Worlds and Swirls Quilting, APQS Ontario. Here's today's design of the day. It's meant to be an all over. So I'm just doing sort of a, you know, an S curve. And then um, if some of you remember the barbed wire that we did a little while ago, I'm doing that same movement except it's all soft following it down. Just like that. Come up. It's meant to be soft. So it's just sort of that zigzag kind of deal. I'm going to come up over this way and get one going in this direction. In through here. This would look really good on a water themed quilt, I think. Actually, it kind of looks like octopus legs. So it's June 2nd today, and we have Quilt Canada coming in 13 days. So excited about that. We're going to have a nice big booth. Um, APQS Canada will be there. That's me. And um, I'm going to have... Uh, my new panographs from Urban Elements that Patricia Ritter and I have done together. We'll have those in the booth. And we're also going to have in the booth the Ideal Seam Guide. Um, the people from there are going to be demonstrating the coolest product ever. So hopefully we see you out. So this is kind of cool, right? You can make these shorter or have them really long. It's totally up to you. And if you mess up like I just did there, I have no idea what that's supposed to be. There you go. Just follow it down. Change your direction. You could certainly do this as an all over. Just let it be loose. The whole idea of this one is that it's it's all soft. Covers a lot of ground pretty quick too. There. I hope you like that. I'll just scooch in here and come down here. There we go. So that's today's design of the day. Neat, right? I like it. Make sure you take the time to doodle, and we'll see you tomorrow.